when the Dali cargo ship collided with Baltimore's Francis Scott Key Bridge in the early hours of March 26th, collapsing it, shock radiated across the city and the United States. In the midst of the chaos, a human tragedy unfolded. Six construction workers who were filling potholes on the bridge perished. Their sacrifice highlighting the dangers of construction work, a profession overrepresented by Hispanics and Latinos in the U.S. At a Monday evening prayer service for the fallen workers held at the Sacred Heart Church, the community congregated to honor their memory. It is important for us to respect and honor their contribution and in this particular circumstance to see how best we can be creative in assisting the families. Not only are families here without a breadwinner, without a father, without an uncle, without a loved one, back home they are also feeling the pain, not only at a financial level, but also at an emotional level. Residing in the Baltimore area, these men were Latino immigrants from Mexico and Central America. In recent years, the city has seen an influx of immigrants from Latin America who actively contribute to the local and national economy doing high-risk jobs. They are the essential workers. They are the people con literally constructing our roads, constructing our homes, constructing our buildings. These are not people who have come across the border to do horrible things to people. They are part of our society. They are our neighbors. They are our community. While the macroeconomic impact of the Key Bridge collapse is top of mind for government officials and businesses, this tight-knit community is in mourning. I've thought again and again in my mind and heart, though, about the families of the men who lost their lives and how suddenly it happened and how uh, violently it happened. These men, these fathers, these husbands who died, leaving behind families. Baltimore's Latino community, like those across the nation, often labors under harsh conditions for low pay and minimal worker benefits. I will lift you from all your and yet, in the face of tragedy and adversity, a coming together in hope and faith. Here at Sacred Heart Church in Baltimore, a community gathering to remember the six men who died when the Francis Scott Key Bridge collapsed. Their loss not only felt by their loved ones, their community here, as well as in their home countries, but as frontline construction workers, their deaths a loss to the United States. Poppy and Putin, CGTN, Baltimore.